It's pump out day. Warning, our content may not be suitable for children. Hi Pelicans and welcome to Sea City Life. My name is Susan, your narrator, and this is my awesome husband, Maverick. Hi. And this is SV Halcyon. She's a 1980, 27 foot Hunter Cherubini. She's currently located in the foothills of Austin, Texas on Lake Travis. With retirement just around the corner, our plan is to purchase a liveaboard so that we can travel around the world. So one of the great cruiser debates of 2020 is whether or not you should have a marine head on board or whether you should have a composting toilet. Both systems definitely have their pros and cons, but we really have learned just being on the lake that a marine toilet is pretty easy, especially if you have a pump out station in your marina that's right around the corner and easy to get to and free of charge. That's always a plus. However, free and easy doesn't always equate to fun. And we're going to learn that here in about three, two, one. What do you need me to do? Oh, I don't, I don't know. I'm just... <sighs> but don't worry. I'm fine. I just haven't had my morning coffee yet. The system is pretty easy, actually. We just pull up to the pump out dock and there's already fitting sitting in a box for each different kind of boat. So Maverick finds the fitting that fits our boat the best and snugs it down, snugs the uh, poop line out, I guess if that's what you want to call it, and then turns the pump on. Yeah. The pump out station is actually used quite a bit. So the marina makes sure that this bad boy is pumped out once a week. It doesn't look that bad right now because we will pump out and then we'll put some water back in and try to purge the tank as much as we can. It kind of cuts down on some of the gray water, black water smell in your boat. So that's kind of one thing that we've always done is we'll pump out, refill with some water and then pump out again until it starts to get relatively clear. And then I feel like once we've gotten to a relatively clear point, we'll call it a day and put some chemical in there and Go about our business. It's definitely not a glorious job by any means, but we're super thankful to have it. So most marinas that have pump outs will have a bunch of little fittings. And those are for different styles of boats, different styles of, of uh, black water valves, I guess you could say. So that's the one that we use, and it just unscrews once we're done. Don't drop these. They don't float at all. At You would think a small piece of plastic should float, but it doesn't. And don't wrench them down. Don't monkey fist tight them or else you'll never get them out. They'll swell and contract and all, do all kinds of stupid stuff. And then you'd be out here with a screwdriver beating the thing off the deck. I'm so excited. My family is almost here. I can't wait to see them! If you haven't noticed, I'm pretty excited. My dad and his wife Renee and her grandkids, Ava and Alex, Hello came guys. for a visit today. How are you? Yay! We're here, Sears! So uh, yeah, that's not our boat. My dad is a CPA by trade, but is also an avid sailor. He's also taken several sailing trips over to the Bahamas with Maverick and myself. 
After our last Bahamian trip, he swore up and down he would never go sailing without Maverick ever again, especially getting stuck in this little gale coming right back into Fort Lauderdale. Well, there were definitely no gale force winds on Lake Travis today, and we had an amazing sail. And Cooper was definitely content getting all the love from Nene. The winds today were perfect. They were consistent and steady, blowing out about eight knots. And then it was time to say goodbye. Sis, drink the wine, okay? Okay, Sis, we'll drink it tonight. Wine. <laughs> right at 183. Perfect. Bye. Love you. Enjoy the boat. Enjoy it. Yeah, that's good. Don't come back. Oh, absolutely. Don't come back. Uh, you know, or the worst thing is we'll just go motor someplace, drop a hook, we'll eat like champs, drink like fish, and that'll work. Woohoo! Alrighty, see y'all next trip. Bye, love you! Bye. Gotta be careful going home. Or to the hotel. Or, yeah, to the hotel. Or somewhere. Well, it was a good day with the fam. God, you are so sexy. Don't sit there. Just went straight from suit, straight back into shorts. So you know, nice. so I love it. you know, no underwear. No, no. Oh, well, that's yeah. all good. Let's go swimming. Okay, let's go swimming. We have friends in the water. We do and have friends if, in the even water. Even if we don't have friends in the water, we should go swimming. We should go swimming. All swimming, right. Swimming, swimming, swimming. Shots of tequila. Say bye.